Well, good evening everyone. Today I've decided to uh, try planting a pineapple from the top. I've tried this before, but it ended with a complete and utter failure. The pineapple died off because I kept getting a lot of gnats and rotting down in what was left of the fruit itself. But I did read that there is a way of making this easy and I simply left the fruit attached and it rotted. So I'm going to attempt what I had read before. First I'm going to get a little bit of soil for the pineapple. Just standard potting soil. I don't believe it takes anything special. Water it up. I always keep bottled water at room temperature for my plants. But the technique I'd heard about is you take it and you twist it to break it loose. I've got my trash can slightly off to the side. And then you tear off between three and five layers of leaves going upward, pulling them sideways. That way it can expose some roots and allow the plant itself to grow better. I've never actually attempted this technique, so this may end in complete failure, but I think it'd be fun to give it a try. I enjoy plants. It's always nice to see them grow. And pineapple always is very pretty. So let's see. Alright, maybe that'll be good. Like I said, I've never tried this before. We'll see how it goes. Snip off a few of these broken leaves. You know, make it look nice. Little trim. Alright, then the next part in the technique I'd read is you simply twist the top into the soil until it settles. And then you water the pineapple itself by pouring water into the leaves. And it's my understanding that this standing water will water the plant itself as needed. So as long as it doesn't dry out, then it should be fine. This does. All right, sorry about that. I neglected to charge my batteries up earlier and lost the last bit of it. So what I was saying was I'm willing to believe that this keeps itself watered through the top of the leaves because, you know, they're set up to hold water. This is a plant that normally grows in arid areas, so it would be important for it to hold in as much moisture as possible. So I'm going to let it stay just like this. I'll add water once every uh, every few days as it dries out of the leaves or is absorbed and we'll check back in maybe once a week, once every two weeks, see how it's going. Hopefully in a year or so we'll see a full grown pineapple. But uh, I do apologize for the interruption earlier. I neglected to charge my batteries up. Anyway, thank you for watching.